and I'm doing it for my daughter. Someone said roast his house. You just bought a house? Yeah. Someone said roast his house. Is there stuff on his house on there? I'm just, I'm excited for him to get really fat. West Hollywood home, sweet. He bought a house in West Hollywood. It's a very good place to buy a three, three million, but it is centrally located. Let me see it. Okay, good. Yeah, that's all right. Nice skinny piece. <laughs> uh, Equaterra uh, permeable pavers. <clears throat> uh, ugly door that looks like uh, uh, Chris Novoselic. No, not Chris Novoselic. Uh, who's the guy? The, James who, Addiction. Yeah, they yeah, have Perry Perry Farrell <laughs> designed the door. Uh, cheap window in the front. You'll change that though, I'm sure. Uh, nice cabana to your front yard where you look and stare at the top of your car that's in your driveway. Um, your house is 12 feet wide. That's nice. <clears throat> If you were in that room, you'd look humongous. It's a restoration hardware shelf, restoration hardware table. It's all stage furniture. A fucking rad ass carpet that they picked out, but it's all fake furniture anyway. So, there's a skinny room. Skinny, okay. okay, guys, we got this 16 feet of the house. <laughs> White waterfall Carrera, IKEA cabinets, um, backyard. It's a fancy microwave, probably. He got the good microwave. Uh yeah, a mi microwave. Uh, yeah. Well, yes. it came with it, so it was the last the last tenants had a good taste in yeah. microwaves. Yeah, uh, the last uh, <laughs> fucking nine oh Beverly Hills nine oh two one oh reject that lived there. No, um, so IKEA cabinets around the TV. Nice hotel look. That can't be that that fucking furniture can't be staged. If they staged a poorly made bed, that's fucking <laughs> the fucking photo editor should fucking <laughs> them fucking <laughs> their thighs. <laughs> I hope the photo editor is at Hot Topic right now, being a goth girl. <laughs> I wish I could make a better, I wish I could make a better bed <laughs> for clip art. I wish I could make a better clip art bed for my mom, who's a realtor in West Hollywood. <laughs> nice. Tile bathroom, hotel. Oh, they got a weird egg tub. It's I guess strange. Yeah, it's kind of Doesn't weird. The water get mm. everywhere? Yeah, it looks like a, like a fucking Saudi build. It's just like a, like a weird flip house. Mm. As you can tell because like the the decking on the front are from like the original like the pool's concrete the deck is original the front like spanish terracotta style was never updated so they just like kind of updated the finishes in the inside there's a nice pool uh nice it's probably one of those side streets back there where bums each other in the alleyway and then come over the bushes in the morning and fucking fucking kill your dog and try to shoot you <laughs> you're a fucking captain phillips sitting in your living room when you wake up <laughs> i just need some food <laughs> you, you go and make me some food. I'm the captain now. <laughs> it's hot tub. The pool sold them. Um, the house sucks. That pool looks pretty bad. That pool bad, sucks. Man. The house sucks. I don't care what you say. You call me a fucking asshole. Call me out for the house fucking blows. It's low quality. The brick is low quality. The stucco finish is no old. They, they painted it brown, which tells me it's old. That's from like 1994. I know all the, there's probably a neighborhood association that doesn't allow you to paint that a different color. Mm -hmm. Um, but it's fucking ugly, and it's three million, so it's eighteen thousand a month. I'm glad that people are fucking. Uh, and yes, you're right. You do have a nicer house than uh, your house is nicer than me, but you do have more money than me. So, mm -hmm. yeah, you're right. I am a fucking hater. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I hope for God's sake, uh, uh, maybe some something crazy hides in that alleyway. But yeah, I got no, you know. I got no beef with you. My beef's with the house. <laughs> Yo, like My beef is with the guy daughter. who flipped your house. <laughs> is that a nano wall? Can you go back to the living room inside looking outside? Uh, right there. Oh, they did put a nano wall in. They put what a, is a nano wall? Oh, a folding, a, like a folding hideaway door wall thing. Those are 10 grand, mm. 20 grand for a good one. Mm. I can buy one for 10 grand. That was 30 grand. Mm. This guy I know has got one. Mm. I wanted to put one. It's 30 feet long. What it's is, like an accordion door of glass. Accordion panel. door that goes like in. The, see them? See okay, the black? Okay. So those will both either push in. They open all the way. They'll fold and then they'll fold again, or they'll like accordion. Sometimes they scissor. They're really nice. That's probably like an Amazon one based on the rest of the finishes. But imagine spending two and a half million dollars on that shit. Yeah. I showed you guys what you can get for a million eight. Mm -hmm. You live in that in West Hollywood? Mm hmm. And you showed us the $25 million Newport mansion. Show that one. Do we have any houses to look at? Um, People we, crave it. Mm -hmm. Can you look? Did you see the, the girl at TwitchCon that broke her back? Yes. We watched, we watched, star? Did we watch the clip? No. You didn't see the clip? Nope. We, go, we gotta do this. We gotta look at this. It's really funny. What was? Her, isn't she like hot as shit too? Poor thing. I don't think so. No, nah, I think she's really pretty. Well, let's look up if she's hot first. Does she do hardcore? Or does she just do nudies? I think she does uh, dr uh, dry hopping only. Clothes on over the hand. Acta. Yeah, she's beat. She's done. Yeah, she's well. Oof. 
Didn't she have an abortion, uh, a miscarriage eyes. too? Did you see her back? What happened? Her what? fucking back has like a scar like this big on it. Yeah. And I think she had a miscarriage. It's kind of sad. Oh, man. Yeah, she's beat. She's fucking dog. Which, uh, wh where's the beat girl? That's a dog. Let's watch the, um, let's watch this chick. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Great victory there. <laughs> oh, no. Ouchie. Are you okay? Are you okay? She's held down by the pitbull medic. Are you okay? Gravity. No, no, she's fine. All right, we'll make sure she's okay. Get her out of the pit. Landed on her tailbone. Yeah. Oh, no, she's fine. That's the worst thing to hear when you're, like, injured. Yeah. Someone saying, "Yeah, you don't want to hear that." You know what a lawyer heard? What's that? Get in my car and get to that girl. <laughs> a lawyer was like, <laughs> he took a fucking Japanese bullet train to that girl. You know what's strange, dude? What? You guys watch Adam Twenty Two, right? No. You know who Adam Twenty Two is? Why would we watch that? <laughs> I don't know. I just see it on TikTok. Like he's like he's, okay. he's like a master yeah, cedar. You can't escape the clips. He can't, sure, yes, yeah. yeah, he's everywhere. But the the um, I think the the audience is like continually the mass like adam 22 is massive he makes a million dollars a month or probably more now at this point just from sponsorships uh just from advertising he's like uh the type of when you get when you need that type of audience appeal like when you want to branch out and get a bigger and bigger audience you you have to like you're now looking at like indians yeah and like guys that are guys that are like um like right over a burger king grill yeah. using using their phone over the burger king grill mm -hmm. like the people the people that you have to draw in to have an audience that big is you're, you're like scraping the um the gruts like the grime of like a hard container like non-collector streetwear wearers yes like footlocker enthusiasts yes. you're talking it's like champ sports yeah this is people with 75 iq yeah people who don't have the, like the good drip yeah people who just have drip adjacent they're wearing it's not worth it <laughs> yeah yeah, yeah like drip. they're wearing like fila <laughs> yeah, and yeah. it's not good yeah like it's just they have a huff a huff hat yeah yeah and like uh <laughs> like just cheap like journeys clothes and shit but yeah there's there's some people and if you look back i mean if you watch movies or if you go to college if you're if you're if you watch higher end podcasts or whatever if you're just like a normal person you might have the impression that we're like that were evolved beyond medieval peasantry. And there's like yeah. the image of like the medieval peasant was this person whose teeth were coming all out at angles like this. And they were, they had like a turn, like their head was like a turnip, like interchangeable. Yo, guys, he he tossed, he Eyes this close together. Foof me, foof me, Lord. I don't think I'll be there for that. A fungal would do the bump duty. And he was uh, more moral. But these people, yeah. But those, those people still exist and they're, they're like, they have phones. And they're the main users of the phones. They're the ones who use the phones the most in the greatest number. So content is going to be increasing as they get as they get cheaper. Like it used to be the case ten years ago that a person like that couldn't ha wouldn't have streaming video mm -hmm. fast on their phone, but that's totally different now. So now that you're going to just watch the and you're just going to watch the landscape continue, like the algorithm, the TikTok stuff. I mean, people talk about it; it's a meme to talk about it, but it's going to continue to get worse and worse and worse. Because access to phones that play streaming HD video or whatever are now becoming, it's like a worldwide thing. It's, it, but the, the level of, I guess, degeneracy that comes along with it, like the content bar is so low. Yeah. I, I don't mean, even, I think there's a part of it that's like, it's not as, it's not as nefarious in that instance, like the job happening. Like, I think, I think it's like, um, it's kind of like an in innocent predation type thing. Like the guys watching, they're going, "She got good head game." Like they're just stu they're just stupid. They're not like yeah. They're, no, I'm not saying they're like fucking uh, putting down the beaker in the uh, you know in the centrifuge yeah, yeah, and then yeah. like <laughs> hopping on over in their fucking like Volvo wagon yeah, yeah. to watch like Adam Twenty Two watch a black guy get on his fucking podcast for like ten minutes before him and his wife finally decide to leave so he can like her back out. What's that? It's a Porsche thing, but I I want to look up the Adam Twenty Two. It's, uh, I guess it's like a, he runs like two podcasts and then like he's got these like fucking strip ghetto hood and good for him. I'm not knocking him or any of the girls and good for you girls who are, you know, 
selling your to get done by Trey Songs. You know what carbon Kevlar is? No. It's so beautiful. It's a green carbon fiber. Mm. Anyway, can Joey, can you look up the can you look up the clip? I want to see what the comments say. Adam twenty two is super huge. Yeah. How where where would you find like the list of rankings of the hugest? I guess you can't really. It doesn't aggregate him because it doesn't compare him against like a tw the top Twitch streamers, right? What? It's like all different platforms. Oh, him? No jumper? Like where they're at? Oh, it's yeah, like, like a, he, it's like a Patreon. Like people watch his. Oh. Where do they? He's oh, he's got a Patreon. Patreon. Snapchat. Cool. Jesus, that, that's the that's the evidence that's the evidence for what I'm saying right there. It's on Snapchat. That's like his third link that he's showing. Yeah, you. it's like the the runoff of like the clout culture. Yeah. Thing. I can't believe that's still like a. But I want to know where he falls against like the top Twitch streamers and all that. Like he's drink got, champs. He's got 1.6 million on Instagram. That seems kind of low. Uh, probably because this is his main and not. Uh... Oh, the no jump. What's the no jumper? Got? It's uh, oh, uh, is it plug 2. talk? 2.9 million. Okay. Which is now just like a. This is so strange. This format. They're just like video. Hosts. Yeah. And uh, they're like rappers and shit. You know, mm -hmm. I mean, they're getting like flown out. But these are the chicks that talk about like getting. On in Dubai. All right, guys, I just... <laughs> <laughs> Did he get hit in the head? Yeah. <laughs> just wanted to give you a little bit of an update about the Patreon slash OnlyFans for No Jumper. If you want to watch <laughs> the podcast in their entirety with no ads, that's all available on the Patreon. Also, we do a weekly well, OnlyFans update. interview. <laughs> and they gave, they do all kinds of great this sexual stuff. Like... You have to see <laughs> me, Flacco, and AD, T-Rail, whoever's is co-hosting with me. If you want, you can sign up on OnlyFans.com slash No Jumper instead of the Patreon because sometimes if the girls get truly nuts, we have to post it on OnlyFans instead of Patreon. It's basically exactly the same thing. A little bit of the clips will make its way to uh, YouTube. This guy's like a psycho money-making machine. He's from New Hampshire and he's a BMX guy. He's he's, so pro he's, he's probably making like good. He probably makes twenty five million dollars a year. No, I think it's I bet it's more than that. Really? Yeah, because he said in a clip years ago that he made a million a month on sponsorships on advertising. Oh, so now he's got like all. He of probably them. makes like five at least. He might he might make more than five million a month. I mean I don't even know, but it's it's. Oh like, my god! And you see and like you pick up on all the little optimization things. <laughs> We should just do burping and farting and subtitle it like Bangladeshi. All right, guys, I just want to... <laughs> we should do that. This rapper beef shit is so... These guys should all just fucking drive really fast into walls. <laughs> this is so stupid. But this dude getting uh, brain... Getting was... Uh, is just... It's I, too far. It's just... I think, honestly, it's just reached a point where it's like the... Mm, click that. What's that one? Lean into the plug. We do <laughs> okay, okay. I feel like we're it's having like, like a conversation with our bro. Oh my god. Anyway. Like this is the slipperiest slope I've ever seen. It's like going into hell. It's like direct direct path to hell. It's fucking Sodom and Gomorrah, man. 